Hi, I'm Pam Dyson with the St. Louis Center for Play Therapy Training, here with another play therapy tip for you. I found a miniature-sized bowling game at a um, discount department store. I've seen them in various sizes for various prices. Cheapest I've seen was $2.50 up to $5, and if you get some that are more of a standard size, you can maybe pay five, six, seven dollars for those, but they're very affordable. I like this miniature set. It's a good size to fit in my playroom, and also if I need to take it with me, it's very portable. This is a great game to use with children who maybe struggle with impulse control, children with ADHD tendencies as well. You line up the bowling pins. I like to line them up in a box. This is a box that Gatorade came in. I cut off one end of it. Gives you a little bit more of a containment so the bowling pins aren't scattering all over the room. So a little bit easier to pick up and clean up and, and reset the game that way. And what happens is the child rolls the bowling ball down and however many pins they knock over for each one, they have to freeze for two seconds. So in this particular instance, I knocked down one, two, three, four, five. Five times two is 10. So the child and myself, we would freeze like this for 10 seconds. And then we would repeat it. We'd line them back up and uh, bowl again and, and play it in the same way over and over. So And um, praising them for being able to freeze for X amount of seconds. And those children could probably manage that. So they're going to feel successful at being able to um, follow directions for a few seconds at a time. Another idea that I also come up with is you could put a feeling face sticker underneath of the, the pins. You could draw it on with a permanent marker. This one happens to be a little sticker face that I found that you could put underneath. And you could also use that then as an opportunity when one fell over to um, acknowledge what that feeling face might be and something that makes them feel in this instance sad. So, um, if you've got a bowling set laying around or you can find one affordably, um, get you a box, cut the end off, set up a bowling game, and use it to teach children impulse control.